After students have taken an assessment on Inner Orbit, and you have free response questions or modeling questions to grade, head over to your grading tab. There you'll see the names of each of the assessments that students have answered questions for that require grading. In your grading tab, we'll separate each question out so you can grade one question at a time and look at all student responses for that question. For modeling questions, we'll give you an example full credit response. Please note that student answers and what's considered full credit will vary wildly. In the future, we'll have multiple responses up here showing you what an example 0, 1, 2, 3, or 4 is. But for now, we only have one example, and that's a full credit response. Click Grade Free Responses to get started. As you move down, you'll see the example response follows you, and you can enter a score for each student. In addition, you can also give them feedback. In some cases, your students answered questions where a model was drawn, and an explanation for the model was also provided. In this case, click View All Answers. You'll be able to see your students' explanation for the model and the model that they added. Use the arrow keys to easily move down from one response to the next, and when you're done giving all students a score between 0 and 4, scroll to the bottom of the page and click Save All Scores and Feedback. For free response questions, we give you bullet points of criteria of what we're looking for in the student responses. In addition, you'll see these highlighted phrases on the right-hand side. We place words in here that will be highlighted in student responses to help speed up your grading process. Auto Man mentioned reflect, absorbed, and transmit, so I'm going to give them 4 out of 4 points. Each of these will be graded between 0 and 4 points. If you want to add additional words up in the pink box, or misspellings, or any other words you're looking to highlight, add a comma and type in the word that you're looking to add. Immediately you'll see that word highlighted in all of your student responses. The goal is to speed up the process of grading and allow you to quickly scan through and see that Darth V only mentioned bounce and reflect, and so we'll receive a two out of four. The grading criteria will follow you as you go down the page, and the highlighting phrases will follow you as well, so you can always add in misspellings that students have as you're moving through all their responses. When you're done, don't forget to click Save All Scores and Feedback. That way, scores are saved in our database, sent out to students, and they can review their scores and feedback in their own accounts. The scores and feedback also go directly into your reports, so you can view performance expectations associated with that assessment and look at what aspects of the standards students struggle with or where they were highly successful. If you ever have questions through any of this, reach out via our chat box. We'd love to hear from you, and I'm looking forward to seeing you and your students on Inner Orbit. Thanks for watching.